So 21,000 sounds like a lot of money for a motorcycle, but what you get is one of the most powerful bikes on the planet, super cheap to operate. All I pay is insurance. All my energy is free from sunlight. And I, I know where all the free chargers are in town. So I've literally paid $3 for energy. I really got emotionally sucked in the first time I drove one <laughs> and figured out that I actually like torque and horsepower more than most people rightfully should. <laughs> Very fun to drive, cheap to own, quiet, smooth, clean. It's still paying for itself. It's, it's wonderfully efficient. But beyond that, the, the car's just been fun and easy and quieter and better. Clean energy doesn't cause sickness or illness in, in humans, doesn't kill people. Cars can drive on sunlight. I've been doing it for since 2002. That's the main reason to do it, but there are a lot of benefits above and beyond that. You're gonna save a lot of money because the fuel or the energy to power an electric car costs on order of about 20 to 30% that of gasoline. They, they destroyed thousands of perfectly good electric cars that people wanted to buy. That's never happened before. In much of America, they don't believe electric cars are viable at all. At the end of the day, electric cars are simply better cars. Have an open mind. Uh, it's an interesting question to see where the electric cars are going in the future. The development over the, over the years of the cars, the electric cars have been phenomenal. Take this and spread the word. Talk to them about the data and the science. You're not having to drive a, a, a substandard car. The car you get that drives on electricity is better than any car you've ever driven. It's not a monumental large step that you're taking. You are, you know, looking out for those generations and, and doing the right thing.